Greetings, family. YouTube. What's up? This is Farmer Son prepping. Uh, hope y'all doing well today. Uh, we got some packages today. Uh, to open. Kind of a prepper mail, I guess you'd call it. Packages. Um, but before I get to all that, I would like to say a huge thank you to TJ Preps, to Bigfoot Prepper, and Lake Ferry Prepper. Uh, they they helped me get to 500 today, uh, and so thank y'all. Y'all didn't have to do that. Bigfoot didn't have to do that. Uh... New subs, welcome. This is Farmer Son Prepping Channel where we talk about prepping and not news and other stuff. There's plenty of channels that do that and do it awesome. So I try to stick strictly with prepping, y'all. Uh, I'm from, I live in Alabama, so I'm from the South. And uh, so trying to preface for the new, for the new guys that just come on board. Thank y'all for subbing. Uh, and we hope that you like the channel. There's uh, plenty of videos to go watch. We appreciate you watching those and watching this one as well. So, yes, thank you, Bigfoot, again. TJ Preps, Lake Ferry Prepper, thank y'all. Y'all are awesome. If y'all ever need anything, y'all just holler at old farmer son here. We'll do what we can. Uh, okay, I ordered some books from my prepper library uh, and I thought I had another package coming in but it has not arrived so I, I'll just do that in another video off the wall prepper is supposed to be sending me something uh, as a gift for being on his live stream y'all go check out off the wall prepper too y'all he's got an awesome channel and you'll see a lot of me over there I'm over there uh, every now and then so I'll go over and check out Off the Wall Prepper as well. All right. Packages. What did we get today? All right. Here we go. Let's get the cold steel. Let it go to work right here. Yay, styrofoam pellets. They make a mess on my floor. Okay, we got looks like we got two things here in this one. Yep, that one's done. Okay, here we go. Item number one, backyard medicine. Uh by Julie Bruton uh, Seal and Matthew Seal. Harvest and make your own herbal remedies. Uh, updated and expanded second edition. So this is how to make medicine from things that are in your backyard. Hope y'all can see that. I don't. Maybe I've got enough light in there. So there's book number one for my prepper library, uh, or book number two, I should say, because I've got that other uh, SAS survival guide is book number one. So this is book number two. Here we go, y'all. Uh, I got this one for my area. I tried to find one specifically for Alabama, but could not. Or the ones that I did find were sold out. Southeast Foraging, 120 uh, wild and flavorful edibles uh, from Angelica to wild plants. And it's written by Chris Bennett. Bennett. Give y'all an, an up close. Maybe it'll focus there. So, it says it covers Alabama, Arkansas, Georgia, Kentucky, Louisiana, Maryland, that ain't in the South, uh, Mississippi, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, Virginia, West Virginia. So, covers all these states. Black mustard, black birch, blackberry. Apparently, it's all uh, alphabetically. Y'all, so that's cool. Southeast foraging. 
Yeah. Can't wait to dig into that and uh, see what kind of stuff is around me. Y'all, I've tried the uh, the little apps, but they're all paid. You, you get to use it twice, and they're like, you need to pay us whatever. So as far as the picture of this and all those apps, no. I'll just buy a book. All right, y'all. Package number two. Feels like another book. Um, let's see here. Hope everyone had a blessed weekend. Uh, today is Monday. I had to, uh, I actually, uh, was privileged and got the blessing of going and watching two young ladies, uh, get baptized this Sunday, last Sunday. Uh, so that was a, truly a blessing. All right, what we got right here? The Survival Doctor's Complete Handbook. This is a used book. You can buy used books and pay a little less. This one is in excellent condition. And, uh, it looks like duct tape, y'all, but it's, it's not duct tape on the side. That's just the theme of the book, you know, backyard. So the Survival Doctor's Complete Book, What to Do When Help is Not on the Way, James Hubbard, M.D., M.P.H. I don't know what that stands for. Stranded when camping, uh, live alone or in a rural area, or just want to be prepared for the next natural disaster. This is the book for you. So... Hope y'all can see that okay. So, those are my three books that I got today for my Prepper Library. Or, uh, three additional books for my Prepper Library, because I already had one. So, awesome. Y'all, I, I can't wait to dig into this stuff and learn something. And, uh... So get you some books for your prepper library because, uh, you know, if the, if the whole digital internet thing, if all that stuff goes down, this is what we'll be relying on. Make sure you get books with nice crystal clear pictures of plants and stuff. That way it's easily identified. Uh, so yeah, appreciate y'all watching. Uh, I guess I'll do a video of off-the-wall preppers thing when it comes in. So I appreciate y'all watching. Uh, this is Farmer Son Prepping. I am the farmer's son. I don't. Uh, I, I grew up on a farm, uh, and my dad still runs the farm. He's in his 70s, uh, and I have to go and help out from time to time. Uh, do things like herd cattle because I've got a border collie. He herds cattle. Um, and just whatever dad needs help with, you know, he's, uh, he's getting a little older. He, uh, he messed his elbow up the other day, y'all, just getting off of a tractor. You know, he's getting to the point where he's getting on and off the tractors, doing him so much damage, he's gonna have to quit, you know. But, uh, tell him that. He's been a farmer all his life, and he's 70 years old, so he's not going to quit. But, uh, y'all, I appreciate you. I appreciate all... 500 of you. Uh, I think it was 505 when I looked at it a while ago. Thank y'all so much for subbing. Hope you'll stick around. Hope you'll enjoy the videos. I love comments. Uh, so please, if you if you want to ask a question or have a comment, please do so. I, I, I try to stay on top of the comments and try not to let them get too far down. Uh, I do not post a video every day. So you new guys, just so y'all know, I'll go a week or two uh, here and there without posting a video. Cause life. That's why. Cause life. Life has to happen. Uh, I am a Christian. And uh, I am a conservative. And I think that's all y'all need to know. Y'all, uh, my end of the video little tagline here. Uh, Romans twelve twenty one: Be not overcome with evil, but overcome evil with good. Remember that God has commanded us all to love our fellow man, even when we want to just pinch our little heads off. Yeah, I know uh, how hard it can be. So appreciate y'all. I've got another video, y'all, that I have tried to upload 
five or six times and it's on the most versatile prepper tools or prepper items but for some reason YouTube will not let me upload that video however I've not given up yet I will continue to try and so if that if you see that video come in this week y'all just know that it was recorded last Wednesday I think so the timing may be out of sorts a little bit on that one if I can get it to ever upload so y'all appreciate it it's farmer son prepping and we're out go prep something today